making sure our workforce is prepared to meet the needs of a 21st century econ economy is a top priority for me. We are working in earnest to reduce barriers to employment so we can try to make sure every available worker can join our workforce. I directed over $150 million to find innovative long-term solutions to our workforce challenges. Because of that investment, we've been able to deliver workforce training and support services to more than 33,000 Wisconsinites across the state. In November, I celebrated National Apprenticeship Week and announced Wisconsin had reached an all-time record high number of participants in the registered uh, apprenticeship program's 112-year history. There are also high-need areas of our workforce we need to bolster and support. My administration launched one of the country's first ever registered nurse apprenticeship pathways to help address the demand for workers. And we announced a new initiative to train over 10,000 certified direct care professionals to address our state's shortage of caregivers. But there's more that we have to do to address our health care industry's chronic challenges. Next week, I'll sign an executive order creating a new health care workforce task force focused on funding, finding long-term solutions to our state's health care industry. We also know we must work to retain talented educators who work every day to do what's best for our kids. So through the Department of Workforce Development, our administration is launching a new teacher apprenticeship pilot program with the Department of Public Instruction to provide more mentorship and support for new educators.